everyone, it's me Alejandra and today in this nail tutorial, uh, the colors, the nail polish that you will need is a top coat, a white nail polish, I'm using OPI, I'm using OPI a lime color, OPI a peach, I mean a orange color, OPI a yellow color, and then I'm using two LA colors. I'm using this LA color, a pink color, and this blue color. And then I have two other ones. I have a green one and a purple one. Go ahead and start adding your top coat onto all of your nails. So once we are finished adding our top coat, we are going to add onto the nails. We are going to start by adding the pink color onto our our pointing finger. So go ahead, add the pink on. And once you are done with that one, let it dry. And then we will go over it with a second Place. Go ahead and add your green color. So go ahead and add your green color. Make sure it is a light color because we are going to add our dark color to the little designs that we are going to make. So don't worry if it looks like this because we are going to do another round of a coat. So yeah, now for our ring finger, we are going to add this blue color. Go ahead and start adding it onto your nail. And these are all Easter colors. And this is why I chose this tutorial because it's about to be Easter time. And yeah. Now, with your purple, I'm going to go ahead and add it onto my pinky. I am also going to add my white because it with this, with this purple, it doesn't really show good on my nail. So, yeah. So, go ahead and add your white and your purple. I'm going to start off with the white first. Now, for our thumb, we are going to use our yellow. No, I mean our... I was correct the first time. We are going to go ahead and add our yellow. Go ahead and add it onto your thumb. No. Once my white is starting to get finished, I'm going to go ahead and add the other basis to these nails because my white is gonna start to get drying i'm gonna wait for it to get um so it could get dry so go ahead and add your other base onto your nails go ahead and add your purple onto your pinky i picked this purple because it was more of a easter color just like that and then if it looks every it's not the color that you want it. Make sure to add more purple. Purple. I'm going to start on my ring finger and you are going to make a bunny. So the way you are going to make the bunny. I'm sorry if I'm doing this wrong. I wasn't supposed to do, go this way the whole time. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with doing it like this. And, I, and now with the white striper, go ahead and make pointy ears and i'm gonna show you how because i didn't bring out my striper so go ahead and add it with the white stripe if you don't have a striper i'm gonna show you another way to use it so you grab your nail polish make sure to swipe one side so it won't have too much now make sure your brush is all nice and thin then go ahead and add it just like 
this. And then you can make another ear flop. Because some bunnies have their ears flopped. So you're just going to do that by taking it over here. like Just like that. So now we are going... Oh, sorry. So now since I don't have a pink striper, I'm going to do the same one with my pink. Swipe it. But first I'm going to make sure it is dry. So after that, on... Our thumb right here, not our thumb, but our middle finger, we are gonna do little carrots. For the for the carrots design, we were we are gonna use this orange and this dark green. Go ahead and make little triangles and do the same thing with your brush just in case you don't have a what's it called? A liner. So you're just going to make triangles like this. Then you can make some off the nail like that. And make sure they don't have to be that perfect because we are going to go over just in case and we messed up. So that's a triangle right there. Then make sure you have some on the... Oopsies, I messed up there. So like that, we are going to go over with our green and fix it. So it doesn't really matter if you get them wrong. So go ahead and do it like that. And you could add more than this. But this is the farthest if it's on my nail. So now with my green, I'm going to go ahead and make the little um, thing just like that. As you can see right here. And yeah. So once I am finished adding my green, I'll get back with you guys. I'm going to go ahead and lay out a couple of white onto the platform right here. And then some yellow too. These are going to be our eggs. So we have these two. Let me add a little bit more and a little bit more to my white. Okay, now with the toothpick, if you don't have a dotting tool, it's okay. And yeah, so we are going to take our toothpick and add little white spots onto our nail. But since I have a dotting tool, I think I might. I'm going to go get, go ahead and get that. So I couldn't find my dotting tool, so I just took a little pin I stuck it onto the top of an eraser of a pencil. And now with my dotting tool, I'm going to grab my white and go ahead and add it just like this. And you can have as much as you want. And yeah. And I'm just going to go on for the centers so I wouldn't look like too much work what am I talking about but yeah this is how I'm gonna go for that's how much I'm gonna have on my nail now with the smaller I think this one you would need a toothpick but with the smaller one I'm gonna take my yellow and I'm actually gonna wait for this the white to dry but I'm gonna go ahead and Add it onto the, whoopsie, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I keep moving my hand. I'm going to go ahead and add it onto the dots once the white dries. Now we are going to move on to the bunny ears. So I'm going to go ahead and make my brush skinny because we are going to add the little, the little pink spots 
onto the bunny ears like this. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add my black to the paper too. And the same dotting tool, I'm gonna go ahead and grab that and add two little dots at the very bottom. Oops, I'm sorry, hold up. Okay, so let's resume. So I'm gonna go ahead and add two little black spots just like this. And then again with, I'm gonna go ahead and clean my tool. And then with the white, for the smaller ones, go ahead and add white. But once it dries, okay? So now let's move on to our pinky. On this one, we will also have egg shapes. So yeah, once I finish with all my egg shapes, I'll be back with you guys. Now my thumb is going to be different. I'm going to go ahead and pour some peach onto the paper. I mean, onto the cover. And do it again. But this time I'm just going to have peach and no white spots onto it. So yeah. If you got messes around your nails, go ahead and take a, a nail brush and just wipe it off. Once you are finished with your design, make go ahead and add your top coat. So go ahead and you're all finished with your manicure. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye! This is what my nails turned out to look like. I hope you guys enjoyed this long video.